At least one person died after an Indonesian flagship KLM Bintang Surya caught fire in the Indonesian waters in the Malacca Strait Sunday. The ship sent a distress call and an Indonesian Navy ship that was patrolling the border waters near Nipah Island, the Riau Islands province responded by approaching it. Bintang Surya was severely burned when the Navy ship arrived at the accident location and Navy personnel managed to evacuate 18 crew members out from the burned ship. 17 of the crew members have minor injuries, but the ship captain named Abdul Jamal did not survive and died, according to the Navy. KLM Bintang Surya was on its route from Singapore to Tanjung Balai Karimunna port when it caught fire. Navy ships have towed the burned ship to nearby shore, while all survivor crews were taken to the Tanjung Balai port for further medical treatment. The cause of the fire was still under investigation, while the Navy deployed at least three vessels on that rescue operation. The Indonesian authorities captured two Malaysian flag fishing boats and 10 Myanmarese crews alleged of conducting illegal fishing in Indonesia's exclusive economic zone in the Malacca Strait last week. Besides arresting 10 ship crew members who were originally from Myanmar, including the ship's captains, Indonesian officers from the Indonesian Maritime Affairs and Fisheries Ministry, who oversees marine and fishery resources, seized over a half ton of fish that they had taken from Indonesian waters as well as radio communication devices, navigation tools, GPS and compasses. The foreign vessels were propped up on the Kuala Langsa Pier in Aceh for further inspection, while all crew have been detained in Balawan Port Station.